How you doing? I'm Callan and this is Slap Tam. Today we're looking at some scary encounters that were filmed deep in the woods. But as always, before we dive into these fascinating stories, remember to hit that subscribe button for more creepy content just like this. In late 2014, Casey Sanders was heading out to the tree stand where he regularly went bow hunting when he had a bizarre encounter. He was shocked to discover a man standing in the creek completely naked. Without getting too close to the man, he begins questioning him. Are you alone? If I see somebody else, this will not be good. The man claims that he was at an EDM festival, Tomorrow World, when a group of men beat him and robbed him of everything, including his clothes. He says that they then dropped him in the woods in an unfamiliar spot. He claims to have wandered in the forest for four days, sucking water off leaves, before coming across the creek and deciding that it made sense to stay near the water source. Casey Sanders is clearly skeptical of the man's story and disturbed by his appearance in the forest. He repeatedly asks the man if anyone else is with him and warns him not to get too close or make any sudden moves. After several attempts to get more information, the nude man finally provides a phone number. Casey Sanders calls the number and arranges for someone to retrieve the man. According to the description of the video, he later walked the man to the nearest street where someone picked him up. He never found out for sure if the bewildering man had been telling the truth. YouTuber Sweet Dreams took to the forest on Independence Day in 2017 to light a few fireworks with a friend. As they dig through their bag of pyrotechnics, they're startled by a high-pitched guttural cry. They decide to set aside their fireworks to investigate the noise. As they navigate through the trees, they suddenly stop when they spot what appears to be a large white creature. It's difficult to determine if it's human, animal or something else. The men quickly run away, lobbing a firework at the terrifying figure. We get out of here. <laughs> Viewers of the video have suggested that the creature was a Sasquatch, or perhaps just a lost and drugged up human. Whatever the identity of the figure, its appearance deep in the darkness of the forest is a terrifying sight to behold. We get the hell out of here. This frequently viewed and highly controversial video posted by a YouTuber by the name of Mr. Gregor begins with a biker strapping a GoPro onto his helmet as he prepares for a ride through the woods. The shot quickly cuts to the middle of the ride as the biker speeds down a woodland path. A moment later, he notices something frightening along the side of the path, a large brown bear. He begins pedaling faster in an attempt to escape the terrifying creature. He occasionally glances back and captures footage of the bear following closely behind him. After fleeing for a few minutes, he's stymied by a large branch crossing the path. He quickly jumps from the bike and runs off the trail to hide behind a tree. The bear follows, but thankfully is scared off by the sounds of nearby gunshots. This harrowing encounter is truly terrifying to watch. However, many have doubted its legitimacy. Some have commented that the bear doesn't look entirely real, as if it's been added to the video using CGI. In fact, an investigation into Mr. Gregor's background suggests that he may be a film student. The common consensus is that the footage is fake, but many still believe that the terrifying encounter is genuine. We may never know for sure if this man really did face off with a deadly woodland creature. YouTube channel NVTV is known for posting videos of creepy encounters that people have had in dark and scary places of the world. The channel specializes in footage of Bigfoot, Sasquatches, Yetis, Skunk Apes and Yowies. They believe that this video likely captured evidence of a Bigfoot. Others who have watched the video believe that the creature is more likely a skinwalker or gin. The video was shot by several men walking in the woods late at night. In the trees, they spot the creature and immediately begin filming. 
The video is dark and all we can see is the glowing reflection of its eyes watching through the leaves. The men are clearly frightened as soon as they spot the creature. However, things go from bad to worse when they witness the creature's speed. It moves so quickly across the frame that the video has to be slowed down to see it properly. The quality of the video isn't great, but there's clearly something eerie hiding in the forest. Is it a Bigfoot, Jinn, or something else entirely? With only this grainy video to go on, we may never know what these men encountered on that terrifying night. In this video recorded and posted by YouTuber Danny Simard, a simple walk through the woods becomes something much more sinister. As Danny Simard is taking a leisurely nature walk, he pans his camera around to record the foliage lining the path. Suddenly, we hear him swear as the camera pans down to the ground along the side of the path. There we see the shiny metal of a gun poking through the leaves. As the camera moves closer, it becomes apparent that the gun and the ground around it are sprinkled with blood. The way the blood shines suggests that it's still wet. We see Danny Simard quickly absconding from the scene, clearly unnerved by what he's just uncovered. He believes that he may have stumbled on the side of a murder. It isn't clear what he does after making this gruesome discovery, but his decision to get far away from the weapon was probably a wise one. YouTuber Freddy Z was not prepared for the scary encounters that he would face when making an innocent video for his YouTube channel. He and a companion set out into the woods one night looking to capture and document some of the creepy crawly creatures that come out when things get dark. After hunting for a while, the pair hadn't had much luck, so they decide to call it a night. In the video, we see them beginning to document the few insects they did manage to find that night, when they suddenly hear the sound of a nearby branch snapping. The camera pans up towards the source of the noise. The camera's light reveals what appears to be a wolf man peering out from behind a nearby tree. The two boys quickly bolt away from the creature. We hear them discussing what it was they saw, but they're unable to come up with an answer. Did Freddy Z really capture evidence of a werewolf stalking in this forest? Meter Addison had apparently been hearing stories about the scary encounters that others had been having near the Umatilla Reservation in the Pacific Northwest United States. She comments that she's finally getting to hear what everyone else has been talking about. As she and a few men walk near the edge of the forest, a terrifying noise suddenly shatters the silence of the night. The noise sounds like a burst of loud, eerie laughter echoing through the trees. The sound comes every few seconds at irregular intervals. So what could be making such a sound? Commenters have suggested a hyena or coyote, but others insist these animals sound nothing like the laughter in the video. Other suggestions have ranged from Bigfoot to witches haunting the area near the reservation. Meter Addison and her companions try to mimic the sound to call out the entity, but receive no reply. <laughs> The forest eventually quiets down, but the group is still too frightened to go any further into the woodlands to further investigate the evil laughter. Before we get to that number one spot and take a look at a truly terrifying missing persons discovery, remember to hit that subscribe button and turn on channel notifications. That way you'll be completely updated about all our latest content. In October 2016, James Rankin posted this unsettling clip to his YouTube channel, Dateline420. When Rankin was walking through the woods near Huntington, New York, he wasn't anticipating any scary encounters. After all, he had hiked these woods numerous times, as he states in the video. However, on this day, he found something truly spine-chilling. 
Attached to numerous trees in a small area of the woods, he spots over two dozen missing person posters in plastic sheet protectors. Each poster featured a different person, and the locations where the people went missing spanned the entire United States. Look at that. These are, these are just the ones that I've gone and closed up, close up. After investigating the area more closely, Rankin also found a dirty blanket and canned food. Most disturbingly, he came across what appeared to be a cage made out of tree branches. Just to make a cage, or a shelter, or a lean-to, or a trap. In the video, Rankin is clearly disturbed by his encounter. He theorizes that the spot he's discovered was a shrine erected by a serial killer to memorialize his victims. He was so disturbed by his discovery that he reported it to local police, who agreed it warranted investigation. They later informed him that the landowner claimed the shrine was set up for a Halloween party, but Rankin is skeptical. He believes that the detectives wanted to downplay the find and use the approaching holiday as an excuse to mask the activities of a dangerous predator. I'll throw this one out to you. What do you think? Have you seen this footage before? Could it really just be a Halloween attraction? Let me know what you think in the comments section below. If you want more scary content just like this, then check out that video on the top there. Otherwise, there's a creepy playlist right there for you to binge on. Now, if you really want to help us out, share these videos around with your friends and family. Share them on Facebook, Twitter, Reddit. If you could, that'd be super helpful. And that's it for me, I'll see you all next time.